Alright, animated ginger history lesson. The first video I ever published on this channel was my original intro. I was 15 at the time, and watching it now makes me hate everything. I enlisted it a long time ago, so unless you've been holding onto the link like some sort of stalker, yeah, you can't watch it. Which, trust me, is better for all of us. So you probably know me as the guy who talks about the Pokemon anime, uses a ton of Torador music, and is obsessed with whatever a cornet is. But surprise surprise, it wasn't always like that. This channel had literally no direction at first. In fact, it wasn't until I uploaded my Pokemon movie ranking video that my channel got any sort of attention at all. It's also the oldest video I still have up. You know what? Let's go ahead and watch a clip of it. For old time's sake. Pokemon movies. There sure are a lot of them, 21 to be exact. And when a franchise has that many films, <laughs> I hate that voice. Like, is this just how I sounded to everyone when I was 16? That actually explains a lot. Alright, we're not watching anymore. Around 8 months later, I uploaded a follow-up to that video, where I ranked every Pokemon anime from worst to best. Now, I hate this video for the mere fact that I was still in my edgy, uh, Sun and Moon is bad because it's not XY phase that, come on, we were all in at the time. But this video's definitely better than the movie ranking. However, something happened with this video. People started to actually watch it. Like, a lot of people. It currently has over a million views, and bumped me up from about 300 subscribers to around 5,000. It was also the first of my videos to be... DEMONETIZED! Love ya, show pro. Since then, the channel's grown more than I could have ever imagined. Of course, there's the Pokemon anime side of things, the rankings, reviews, predictions, all that jazz. But some of my favorite memories with the channel have been the more out there videos. From determining if it would be possible to live exclusively on Pokemon merch, to uncovering the forgotten Pokemon comic series, and even journeying to incredible places such as Japan and even McDonald's. It's really been such a blast. I could thank you guys over and over for all the support with this excited expression, but to be honest, I don't really think that's enough. Hang on a sec. What's up, Ginger Cornets? See why I didn't say that at the beginning? When I started this channel, I had no intention of ever showing my face, like, period. Yet, here we are. Honestly, making these videos has sort of reignited my love for Pokemon. I went from watching like, I don't know, when there was a cool arc going on, I, don't, I didn't watch the filler stuff, and like, now I'm watching every new episode even before the subs come out. I've like, picked up some Japanese so I could understand Pokemon. It's, it's, I'm, I'm, I'm crazy. But enough of all that sappy history stuff, that's not really how we roll around here. So, let me reintroduce myself. Like, as, as an adult, not, not as a 15-year-old just doing the best with what he's got. So hi, I'm Connor, but most of you probably know me as Ginger. And at heart, I'm just a guy in his room making Pokemon videos that people watch for some unknown reason. My other hobbies involve being a huge nerd, knowing a lot about obscure Nintendo games, such as The Legendary Starfy, which was actually the fifth in the Starfy franchise. There were four others, but they were never released outside of Japan. Strangely enough, the first one had a Chinese release planned, but it was cancelled. And I will also tweet literally whatever I think of at one in the morning, because... content. I think this is the portion of the video where I should like demand you to subscribe and maybe like show a little graph and be like, ooh, look how many people aren't subscribed, hit that bell, something, something, something. But you know what? I'm not gonna do that. Instead, here are some things that real people have said about me. Animated Ginger? Isn't that the guy who like spirited away? Your channel is great, but um, now that you're showing your face, you better change your name from Animated Ginger to Real Life Ginger, cause that would be false advertising. Animated Ginger? I love that guy! Amazing Anapo content, great discussions, and always an interesting and amusing time on his channel no matter what. Was that good? Ginger? Hmm, well, he's definitely a big nerd. Before I knew he ran a YouTube channel, I thought he was just a weirdly knowledgeable guy about Pokemon, which... I guess still remains true. He's got a lot of well-informed opinions that both take into account all sides of the argument and show a big love of the series. Yo yo yo, let's take a look at the legendary animated Ginger's Twitter page and... 
Okay, where's my money, man? This video is probably filled with people leaving sarcastic or joking comments about him, but in all honesty, Animated Ginger is a really funny and clever guy, so you should subscribe to him if you haven't already. If I had to describe the Animated Ginger in three words, I would choose fun, energetic, and kawaii desune. Please subscribe, you won't regret it. Animated Ginger? Oh, you mean the guy I did Zack's Diamond and Pearl review with? He's a pretty cool guy. He has some interesting hot takes, though. An overall fantastic, amazing person. I'm so proud to call them my friend. Wait, we're talking about Ginger? Uh, <clears throat> who's that again? Wait a second. So now that you've done a face reveal, does that mean you're unanimated? Now this is juicy, trainers. But not as juicy as Animated Ginger's Pokemon YouTube channel. So make sure to subscribe if you want real stuff from there. My name's Scrublitz, and I approve of this message. And this juice! Animated Ginger? More like Animated Cringer. Now if all those... mostly kind words weren't enough, here is Lumios Trainer Zach with his official review of my channel. Welcome back to my Pokemon Anime YouTuber Review Series. In this video, I'll be reviewing Animated Ginger. Let's get started. So Animated Ginger uploads sometimes, but when he does, it's pretty good. Kinda wish his videos were longer though. This channel's rating is a 10 out of 10. Ah uh, yes, thank you Zach for that totally warranted score. I know I earned it, I, I get my 10s. But before I go, I just wanted to give one last big thank you to anyone who's ever watched this channel, whether you've been watching for 5 years or 5 minutes. I hope you haven't been watching for 5 years, I've been doing YouTube for like 3 and a half, that would be... that'd be kinda creepy. Anyway, be on the lookout for next week's video, it's probably the craziest thing I've ever done, and I did go to McDonald's at one point. I'd show you Ruby, but I don't know where she is, so... uh... Here's a Psychic-type Pokémon. Anyone still remember that joke? He's in my logo for some reason. Look at you, you little psychic bird. Anyway, I say this at the end of all my videos. It's just a thing I do. I don't know why. I don't remember how it started. But you know what? I'll do it. I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it. <clears throat> See you later, Gator Taters. I did it!